Last month, Indian Motorcycle released all the details on their new Scout Rogue. In this video, I'm quickly going over three things to know more about it. Hey, I'm Lava Trotter on this channel, you get quick motorcycle how-tos, product reviews, and sometimes I cover the latest motorcycles. For more like this, be sure to subscribe. Let's go. So ever since the release of the Scout lineup in 2015, Indian has been known for making cruisers that are sporty and have great styling. One of the first things to know more about on the Scout Rogue is the new wheel size. The Scout Rogue features cast aluminum wheels with an all new slimmer 19 inch front wheel compared to the standard Scout's 16 inch beefy front wheel. This new 19 inch wheel size is what many are saying gives the Scout Rogue better agility during slow maneuvers and in traffic. It also gives this motorcycle a fresh look and gets it away from that famous bobber look. This new tire size coupled with the low seat height and a low center of gravity is what Indian is saying provides superior handling for all riders regardless of experience and skill level. The next thing to know more about is the styling. Combining iconic design and contemporary styling, the Scout Rogue is pretty edgy right out of the factory. It gets a new quarter front fairing that encircles the headlight and creates a look that is both classic and sporty. A really cool thing about this fairing is that Indian is able to color match this for all previous Scout and Scout Bobber models. Also speaking about those models, the new Scout Rogue is sporting a lot more blacked out features than those previous ones. The Scout Rogue also features a new sporty Syndicate solo seat that provides long riding comfort and has an upraised rear lip that keeps riders planted during quick acceleration. The new Rogue does borrow those cool mini ape hanger bars from the Scout Bobber 20 and I think it looks great behind that new fairing. The final thing to know more about on the Scout Rogue is the accessory line. Indian made sure that the Scout Rogue received a proper line of accessories to help make this bike your own. On the performance side of things, you can achieve a smoother ride with increased suspension travel from the adjustable piggyback rear shocks. Riders can also add an auxiliary tachometer with a shift light, and this helps to keep riders aware of the engine's RPMs and lets them know when to shift. On the comfort side of things, there are a lot of options. There's a Syndicate 2-up seat and a Syndicate low-profile passenger backrest. There's also options to add luggage in the form of saddlebags, a luggage rack, and a black water-resistant solo rack bag. Pretty cool. So while this motorcycle does share similarities to the standard Scout, these are just a few things that really stood out to me. Pricing for the Scout Rogue starts at $11,499. Let me know down below what you guys think about this new Scout Rogue in the comments. I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, ride safe and see you next time.